not own any of the rights to the music playing in this video. What's up, y'all? I'm just vibing. Is there like a question thing down here? Oh, there is. You guys can ask me questions if you want. I'm gonna go ahead and get into my story a little bit of just how training has changed my life and helped me save myself. And I wanna say thanks y'all for just tuning in and joining this conversation as well. questions in regards to trading any questions in regards to just like anything also music questions look at my hair this is what happens when you don't lay the edges your edges your creatives you do different things and depending on your circumstance or situations um, that I know where I was born and raised where I came from the things I see if you grew up around me um, or just in the same kind of like environments that I've been in they're very 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 uh, I'm not going to say completely toxic, but, you know, just, just atmospheres and environments that do not prepare young people forward. I don't know why I'm playing with my hair, you guys, so much, but they just don't kind of give you the blueprint or the guide to be able to move forward the way you know you need to um, so that you can just be successful in life, okay? A lot, of, And so that's why I say toxic because a lot of us, we may have grown up in environments or, um, places or just circumstances in circumstances in certain situations been born into certain situations that literally have nothing to do with our path or if they did um you know could we manifest this life um so there's really nobody to blame it, it's like it's like a while or it may seem like it's this long hard journey getting up to the top of this mountain to even uncover um the things that are maybe most important to you or are or, or worth it in this life for yourself. So for me, one of those things that are worth living for, I guess you could say, that's worth it. It's definitely music. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna be talking a little bit about that. I'm just trying to find some music, y'all, to be honest. Cause I, I don't like talking on live. And it's just silence. Okay. Let's get some music. Let's get some music. I just don't want to play nothing copyrighted and then they start stripping. No, we're not even going to do that. We're not even going to do that. I'm just going to. You know what I'm going to do, y'all? I know y'all like, damn, we playing through all the hits. I know, I know. Hold up, little shoddy. Hold up, baby. I got y'all. I'm going to play some, some soul jam music or something. Soul music. You did. Okay. Not too loud. So, yeah, you guys, I've been on the road making 
my life amazing and do trading. Um, just so I'm not rambling on here. I guess to answer the question, how has you know trading changed my life and actually helped me save myself? Not even a question, but the title of the video. It helped me be free. It helped me get my time back. It helped me be able to start to look at what the fuck is important in life. Just like I was talking about the background and a lot of things or the places we all come from. It even might just be a space that you were born up in. Like, like you had everything you wanted, but for some reason it was just something about it that was very like distorted about the shit you was going through as a kid. Like, this shit has helped me be able to just focus on the shit, like, when you were a kid, that just makes you just joyful. Fuck everything else. You start to really see, like, you know, and shout out to Dolo, because he said this, like, life is like, it's like a whole bunch of people out here who, I guess you could say it's just 3% or whatever, and they're looking at life like it's fucking Monopoly, like, and I can't even say Dolo said that, like, I, I take that for me, that's what I say, like, it's like, these people out here who have all this access to all this information or whatever and truly all that has become accessible to us a lot of us we just don't want to tap into that knowledge because it's scary and just like Gary Gray says um, you know the things that you avoid your children will have to suffer from a lot of our parents do do that so then we have those same type of issues we don't want to deal with certain things because it's all this burden and, and energy that comes from all that great responsibility but guess what comes with great responsibility great fucking freedom y'all so how has trading changed my life it's giving me freedom it's giving me the freedom to be like i'm waking up at this time you know and i'm not completely there yet because i still got my own personal business and dreams i'm building too but now i can actually build for it. all right i can build my brand i can build my business all that shit when we were a kid i want to do this and i want to do that yeah i'm actually doing that shit I'm not sitting back somewhere. I'm not sitting back somewhere thinking about it. Oh, and planning to be able to hit that goal or do that thing the next month or tomorrow or the next day. No, I can do that shit today if I want. Okay, y'all. That has trading has has allowed me to be able to rearrange my life and put what I truly desire first and put all this other shit. Oh, you need to go to school. Oh, you need to get this job. Oh, you need to eat, eat, eat. Put all that shit to the back burner. And some of that shit, I don't never got to eat that shit. Like, what I mean, like, I'm in the kitchen creating the life that I fucking want. <laughs> that's what training has allowed me to do, y'all. And that's why I want a lot of y'all to join my team. Especially my friends. You know, you came up with me. You seen me. Like, we going through probably this. We didn't go on through or been through the same shit. So there's really no difference as to where you could be at that I wouldn't even understand if I personally know you like on some first house, third house shit. Like if you, even if you're not into astrology, it don't matter. Even if you're not into the same things I'm into, it don't matter. If you have a dream you and you want to be able to apply as much time as possible and you want to start to create a source of different source of income so that you can actually fulfill and make that dream real and make it happen and be fulfilled in what it is you came here to create and actually fucking do your real fucking purpose. Enjoy my team. Like, that's really why I go so hard for this trading shit. Yo, what's up, bro? I see Brian came in here earlier. Lash, B, King, Inspiration. Y'all make sure y'all show him some love. But yeah, y'all, I go so hard for this trading shit because, like, as an artist, as a creative, like, I don't need y'all to join my team. <laughs> I don't. I just want to do this shit with other people who are into the same thing that I'm into. If you happen to be an artist, if you happen to be a creative of some sort, you know what I mean? If you don't know me, you can look at my body. I, I, you guys, I keep it pretty clear to me. I don't think I... Everything is pretty much out like Leo shit. What you see is what you get. I don't know what to tell you, okay? So how I have trading in my life is allowing me to like, instead of also just seeing all these people online and being like, oh my gosh, they're doing such amazing things and like going to see this fucking comparing whirlwind of bullshit i can actually just take authority over my life and be like this wish this is the way we go into this okay anybody can tell me to clock in you need to be here at this time okay and it's and i'm just at the beginning of my process even where i'm at right now um hanging out with some friends actually and I'm um, currently with some amazing people and 
in my business, okay, and oh, that's on the same team as me, all right, they, we actually work well together, but we're all strangers to each other, and yo, this is just one of the houses that we're at right now, and this person made, this is why, trading is the reason I'm gonna say I'm here where I'm at right now, okay, like, what do you mean, how, how has trading changed my life, like, if anybody ever tells you trading or FX is a scam, no, you just don't know math. You don't have financial literacy. You haven't done the proper work to understand money, digital currency, and where things are going. It's something that they need to personally work out. Do your research, okay? Or just hit people like me up, okay? The real people. I know they got all these little fake IGs out here. They've been duplicating all these, like, amazing people's accounts. Actually, we really fucked up. And my friend's acting up. But, y'all, trading is, like, it's cool to do it by yourself, too. Like, I'm not telling y'all I can't do that. But I'm just saying, like, imagine teamwork makes dream work for real, bro. Imagine have the same goal and you're doing the same thing with other people who are on the same time. You know how much faster you're going to go? I mean, fuck fast, you know much, how much further you're going to go? I once heard from an OG for real, for real. You can go somewhere fast by yourself, but you can go further with others, okay? You can go further together. And so that's really why I'm moving the way I'm moving right now. And I guess, true and how it helped me save myself, it helped me just finally be a problem solver and be like, yo, I'm in this situation, not because of my mama, not because of my daddy, not because of this past trauma or these issues, or, or the ex or the other ex or <laughs> like some type of external allies as excuse or my spirituality in the in the, the chakras of the, the universe and like shut the fuck up y'all like it's not you cannot put why you in the position that you win and blame it on spirituality like rule number one like you cannot blame it on your feelings you cannot blame it on your mama your daddy Everybody has a story. Why do I think I always say life is not fair because it's fair to everybody? So you better make it fair. The fuck? What kind of music stopped? <laughs> I'm not playing with y'all. Like, it's changed my life because I'm not even in the same position I was while. I was just stuck at a job three months ago at my mom's house. Fucking struggling. Like, making it look cute. You know, I make it look cute around this bitch, y'all. But I was struggling in my cuteness, okay? And I was not happy, you know, I was clocking in. And I was like, who the fuck is to tell me to clock? What kind of fucking world do we live in? Like, I was so confused. I was like, this is not in alignment with my truth or my past or what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Now y'all be making terror videos. Y'all see me, I be dropping my music, okay? Y'all think y'all seen something. I ain't even seen them yet. All right, I got, I'm working with different people and teams. I'm doing the things that I love to do, right? I'm traveling, I'm going to different events. I'm working intimately with people one-on-one. -on -one. I love that kind of shit. I'm being able to communicate what matters to me, all right? And so it's not even about the money. It's just about what our group is called. You guys always see me putting those hashtags or we have these rules in the future. ET, Enlightened Truth. Like, my team is different. I don't know what you love a little, no shade to these other groups that they be on, but y'all ain't on the same time that we on. Everybody's spiritual, everybody creative, everybody got a goal, everybody got a passion, and that's what made me save myself, you know what I mean? This, this came to me three times. I didn't take it seriously to the third time, you know? And I think it really helped me save myself when I realized I have to be my own problem solver. Everybody want to say, I'm a god, I'm a goddess. But why are you in the situation that you in? <laughs> why are you living the life that you living in since you a goddess or a god? Okay? Even gods and goddesses or whatever you want to call it, us as co-creators, creators, we got to sometimes start taking spiritual... Fuck sometimes. Start taking spiritual responsibility as to why you're not where you want to be. You set that situation up that way. And this is what I had to realize about getting in deep into spirituality or even the industry and all that shit or whatever you want to call it. It doesn't matter what the fuck you do. When I got into trading, I realized the, the biggest thing I ever realized. You want your life to change, change it. So you don't even need trading to understand that, but just change it. It's just that how I move, we move a little bit different. Like all this shit you see online, how people using this shit, 
All right, so it's not using them. And y'all wondering how they doing it? Holla at me. Like they're like their grace will say, holla at a big dog. Okay, fuck you talking about. Y'all be hanging out with friends who be smoking with y'all all day, but they won't help you invest your fucking money so you can get paid. Fuck you talking about. You you got a plug who will make sure that you pay him that that twenty for that for that weak ass dub. Or that you might even hang out with that's your friend. But he ain't investing with you. He ain't making sure that you get that money back. Shit. Like, we, we, I'm over here. No shade. We need our clubs and shit. But how I'm moving is very legal, baby. And that'd be another thing. You know, people be throwing shade. Because I know, coming from Atlanta, like, we also used to a lot of, like, scamming shit. But I'm just hitting hella topics. Because I just know how people be thinking. And I'm just like, yo, like, a lot of us, we be in poverty, we be in abusive-ass relationships, even with family and all kind of shit. We be in toxic-ass environments, we be motherfucking escapism after wazoo with drugs and shit, and it be our fault. <laughs> it be our fault. We be like, my life this, I don't have this, I don't have that, da, 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 da. And then it be also our language. It's a fucking, the North Node is in Gemini, yo. It don't matter if you from the hood. <laughs> it don't matter how you hustle, but fucking hustle. Hustlers, no hustlers. It don't matter what you came from, what you got. You better make something from that shit, bro. And that's what this shit showed me, like. I was always that hustler. I was always that go-getter. If I needed the fucking money, if I needed something to figure out, you could ask all my friends, you could ask everybody who know me. Don't play. I'm going to make sure I do that shit. I don't do fucking, I'm on my last dollar. I'm going to figure that shit out. Now, if you got that mentality already, then you got kind of person where when you want something, you're going to get it, and you're you going to make sure you do it, and you're going to do it right. You ain't going to, you ain't got to do no shady shit to do it. Like, you, you about it. Shit, even if you did ever do something, I just, I don't want to just, you know, just close off of the other people. Because I know some people, they be in certain situations. But I'm just like, point of period, you got that hustle mentality. Point of period, what I'm doing, you you on that same time. You might just do it differently. Shit, I, I'm not changing for um, anybody or anything, any, any platform. But we have to be wise and realize... We using this phone shit, we using all this shit every day. You, might, you better be making sure you get paid. Don't let nobody stop your coin. Oh, money is the root of all evil. Baby, money make the world go round. Like, even, even all us vegans, holistic, okay, well, who, who, who paying them farmers? That's why I say, are we God's hope? Like, who, who, how are you making sure that you getting back with, like, we be thinking this, these blessings and spiritual wealth is just out of nowhere. Like, no, it's just, it, money is just energy, okay? So we can get all spiritual tapped out, but I didn't really come here for that. I didn't come here for a spiritual message today. I just came here to talk about what I'm already doing and just let y'all know, like, yo, you should be trading. Like, join my team, holler at me, especially if you know me. Um, it don't really matter what level of education you don't have or do have. I didn't know what the fuck I was doing before I joined this, okay? But what I will say, yeah, is this shit really helped me save myself. Like, it helped me become that problem solver. It helped me to stop making excuses. And every time I made an excuse, I wanted to run away from something. It helped me realize this is the reason why I'm in the situation I'm in. And so I changed it. And that's how I changed my life. And I'm still changing it. Because that's why I said, y'all really ain't even seen them. But for those who know me closely, they already know, like, a part of my purpose, yo. This is part of my path. And um, it's bigger than just trading and just money and shit. And that's something that helped me say, that's what this opportunity did. It, it helped me get in tune with not only having that spiritual responsibility over my life, but agency to be like, I can actively change my life. I'm not just aware, like I was saying at the beginning, of this and that and all this information like this 3%. I have this, I have everything I need within. How do I actually then use it? That's what this shit did for me. So that's why I said, everybody can trade. You can hop on YouTube. You can join some little regular sneaky dinky group that you don't feel really connected to. But you, you, you know, you, you talk to somebody like me, you talk to somebody that you actually connect with. 
I'm telling you, your life gonna change. Cause if you join the team, if you join my team, you gonna get, you gonna get, get more than access to just how to make money through your phone. Like what? That's not even. That's why a lot of people are like, oh, it's a scam, it's a scam. Because you probably came into the business to just only think about money, only think about yourself. On top of it, only think about yourself. That's what a lot of people do. They only think about money and they only think about themselves. They don't realize how to impact people. They're like, oh, it's a pyramid scheme. Oh, no, you just probably came in thinking about it all about yourself. Or shoot, sometimes I'm not gonna lie. You join the wrong team. Certain teams, they they do like I can't even I can't even throw shade. Okay, but that's not even possible. Like, like y'all should actually look up what pyramid scheme means. Like that'd be the thing. Like. Do your research, but just if you really want to talk to the source, talk to somebody who's the source of the information. Um, and that's something that, I, that helped me save myself is realizing like a lot of times we be wanting stuff and we be going all around it for it. Even somebody they're gonna watch this video, they're gonna go all around just DMing me and getting clear, direct information from me to figure out what it is that's going on, like to figure to better understand trading and. Whatever, and it's like, bro, I mean, you can hit me up, okay? So, you know, I just like to be gentle with people because I know when I first came on here and I first started learning how deep this shit was, I was definitely like on the attack because I was like, nah, y'all playing, like, motherfuckers are playing. Everybody know me, like, in terms of me being very, you know, when I want to be, I'm, I could get very feisty, and it's not even feisty, it's just, I'm don't look at the sun for too long, you might get your ass burned, you know? <laughs> but for the most part, you know, that's the biggest way it not only helped me save myself, but it helped me put people in position to save themselves and be like, here you go, I'm gonna give you a tool, I'm gonna give you a vehicle that's gonna help you get to where you're trying to go, are you actually trying to go there? So that's why I said, I don't need y'all to join my business. If you don't want to join, you don't know what you're saying, no to. What the fuck? I'm, I'm not gonna stop you. I'm not gonna stop you. Mm. <laughs> Sometimes we gotta tell people they can't join the team because they're not focused. They don't even know what they want in life. Can't do that. Can't hang out with people and they're not on the same time as you or they're not better than you. You gonna become like them, y'all. Like it's all all that cliche corny shit. Oh, the universe reveals a secret to those who believe or whatever. Or all things are possible to those who believe. Believe it, see it, achieve it, jump and you'll make it. Like y'all be thinking this shit stupid this shit is fucking real what you mean how this shit changed my life how i saved myself my, my life is magical i can make whatever i want to make and i just want to help someone else see that shit like the same shit you see in me it's in you no different now wherever you want to go work wherever you want to go with that that's on you but just know that shit you watch this video it's a wrap. You can't go back to your old life talking about in any victimized mentality or enemy you like, oh I don't my dreams. You think I'm sitting some some sitting somewhere talking about my music and why isn't here and this isn't that? No, I peep all shit. It's just I, how I might move and manifest may not be the way you move. It is written some shit is just written in the stars, so it's just gonna be a little different. But that victim mentality shit. That shit is dead, and I realized I came from that too, y'all. Like, I came from that learned helplessness, where you where you learn not to look for help, or you get help, and then you turn it away. Like, what the fuck? You ever seen that? You ever seen a situation where you know somebody needed some help, you helped them, and then they did everything to resist it? A lot of us, we come from that, we don't even know that, or, the learned helplessness can pop up in a way where a person thinks they're incapable. You ever seen a person hit they, they foot or they leg and because they're so focused on the pain, they're like, oh, I can't do this and I can't do that. But if you, like a damn little kid, if you told them, oh, I got some ice cream, they'll just stand up and that's like nothing happened. <laughs> that's how it be. Like, this is a lot of stuff that we be, you know, going through. All my friends want to go get some ice cream or some food, so I'm going to have to go. See, this is what I'm talking about. Shit. Like, shit. I'm just saying, this This is how trading has changed my life. I see a damn text, like, you trying to go out to eat. Oh, they like, you ain't on Jade.
If that ain't the evidence that you need. <laughs> All right, so save yourselves and be free. Hit me up in my DMs. DM me purpose if you're serious. And also, if you like my music, y'all, look in the link in my bio for my music. Peace.